Thursday, August 31st, 2017, Monaco 64, home of alternative economics and contrarian views. So this is a sponsored video for BitClave uh, and their CAT token or consumer activity token. And uh, a disclaimer, I, I, this is not a video to try to uh, make you buy uh, into this ICO or crowd sale. This is just an informative video letting you know that it's out there. So let's first talk about the, uh, the project itself and then uh, some of the details of the crowd sale and uh, the pre-sale as well that they had already in July. So BitClave is decentralized search ecosystem. And uh, they, you know, and I'm reading here from their white paper, it says the 550 billion ads market is about to be disrupted by blockchain. So why is that? So on their uh, website, they explain the problem these days. So he said, and it says, the internet giants come across as the friendliest companies, always doing everything for us, free search, free mail, free chat, always on the edge of innovation. Know how they get there? You. Uh, every time you search or click to, on an ad, they're paid hundreds if not thousands of dollars from the companies behind the ad. And depending on where you live, the price tag could get even higher. Why should you do all the work and they reap all the benefits? It's time to take back the internet and make it ours. Uh, so what's the solution according to BitClave? BitClave is the next generation of data privacy. We believe that your data is your own and that you should have control over who can use it and how. We're building a decentralized search engine that helps you truly find what you're looking for and get compensated for your data directly from the retailers you're interested in. You might ask, why would retailers pay you for your data? Well, because they're probably, you know, they're going to save a lot of money, uh, you know, not uh, buying ads through, you know, YouTube, uh, Amazon, or Facebook, you know, it's a 550 billion ad market. And, uh, you know, from reading the white paper, which everyone should read, uh, everyone that's interested, that would be interested in, in putting money into this, they should read it. You know, it talks about how even, you know, for, it doesn't only hurt the consumer, but it hurts these companies that advertise on these, uh, uh, you know, ecosystems like Facebook or YouTube or Amazon, because apparently 50% of ads are clicked by bots. So it's not real consumers like you and me who are clicking onto it. And a lot of us at use ad blocker or, you know, click out of the advert. So where do you think all these costs? Who, who pays for all these costs in the end of the day? It's us, the consumer. But these comp the companies that advertise as well, they'll be saving a lot of money if, if this uh, solution works out to be uh, something that grows. So I'll continue here about the solution. Uh, compensate directly for your data from the retailers you're interested in, making third-party advertising networks unnecessary and irrelevant adds a thing of the past. BitClave is powered by the blockchain, the world's most private and secure database, so you can rest assured your data is protected. And unlike advertising middlemen, we don't make money off your data. So, um, yeah, they're, they're using, of course, uh, in the beginning, uh, the Ethereum blockchain. In their white paper, it says that they are flexible and that they could eventually change, uh, you know, the currency that, you know, the blockchain that they use. Uh, right now, it's Ethereum. So, what else? Um, yeah, the team. The team seems to be a very strong team. Uh, you can, you know, I'll put the link uh, below to their website. Uh, you sh if you're interested, uh, you can, uh, you know, click on wallet and register for the, uh, the crowd sale uh, that starts on September 15th. Uh, the CEO, uh, Alex Besanov, he's a, he, uh, sen he was a senior execu executive uh, with over 20 years uh, of experience in the security and privacy and blockchain industry. He's the former uh, chief security officer of LG Electronics. 
so yeah, it's quite an impressive uh, list here uh, on the team. I think they've got uh, 25 developers and right now they also have part-time employees, but uh, of course they're looking to grow quite a bit. Uh, I'll talk a little bit uh, about uh, the um, pre-sale they had. So bit in, they, they had a pre-sale uh, in, in July. So it says here in, in their recent uh, uh, press release for the crowd sale in September, in July, Bitclave successfully launched a pre-sale of CAT, which earned over 1.8 million US dollars, demonstrating high engagement from the use, user base. Initially offered at a discount, discounted rate, the Bitclave presale reached its soft cap, which was 1.5 million was the soft cap, in less than 24 hours with extremely high transaction volumes from the moment the presale opened at 4 a.m. Pacific time. Um, and it says, since the conclusion of presale, interest in purchasing CAT tokens, uh, or CAT, has continued to grow along with the amount of users opening Bitclave wallets in anticipation of the full sale. So it goes on to uh, give you some details, which I'll give you of the uh, additional crowdfunding details. The token generation cap, or how the limit of tokens they're going to issue is 2 billion. The crowdfunding is going to be 50% of that, or 1 billion. The exchange will uh, be uh, seven US cents per uh, one token. And the timeline is going to be between the fifth, well, it's going to start on the 15th of September. And uh, technically, or, you know, it should run to the 15th of October. It could end before the 15th of October. Um, and they're looking uh, to raise the soft cap for the crowd sale. Uh, that starts on the 15th of uh, September uh, is 10 million US dollars. And they already, uh, you know, and they're looking to get 1 million uh, users, you know, cons on the consumer side by the end of this year. They And they already have uh, established, uh, you know, uh, relationships with 20 partners. Uh, partner By partners, they mean small and medium-sized businesses that will be, uh, you know, the on the sales side of this uh, ecosystem. Um, so, and they're all over the world, in the US, Europe, Turkey, Asia, Russia, and their website, you know, has English, Chinese, Russian. Uh, so they're, they're quite a big, uh, they're looking to do this globally, of course. And one thing that I found interesting, <clears throat> excuse me, in their uh, crowd, uh, in their white paper, I'm sorry, is, uh, this part here, uh, the deployment plan, it gives an idea of what Bitclave really is and their token. And they're going to use this token basically to incentivize the community to, you know, uh, so the more information you give about yourself to the sellers, uh, the more tokens you earn. And uh, these tokens, by the way, will be traded you can you'll be able to trade them on the exchanges as well after the ICO, uh, but uh, you know you will also earn them if you are part of this uh, you know Bitclave activity search ecosystem, which they call which short is short for it is Base B A S E the Bitclave activity search ecosystem. So. I'll read about their deployment plan. It says, combining the above components, the Bitclave activity search ecosystem acts as a platform for creating customer-driven and incentivized retail opportunity. As the platform provider, Bitclave's primary focus is to establish the, f the core framework of the ecosystem upon, upon which all developers can create apps and services. In one sense, the Bitclave platform is to the retail ecosystem what Facebook is to the social networking. Uh, as such, Bitclave's core offerings to support the business-to-consumer ecosystem as well as business-to-business -business support services, which mean, yeah, will include a core application, uh, which is a browser and an app. It will be browser and app-based, so you'll be able to go on your mobile phone and use the search 
or on your computer or laptop. And the collection of APIs, libraries, and SDKs that will allow external developers to build on, on top of the platform. So basically, they're trying to uh, cut out the middlemen and the, mid, the biggest middlemen in the online uh, advertising business are Google, uh, Facebook, and Amazon, Google AdSense. So actually, this would probably hurt people like me who make uh, YouTube videos, but that's the, you know, I, uh, maybe that's part of the reason why some of the ad revenue has been going down, not only because of uh, censoring by Google, but also because uh, companies that pay for advertisement, they're realizing that they're not getting uh, a bang for their buck, <laughs> so to speak. So everyone has to adapt. Uh, what else? Well, the other thing, that interesting thing they say, this will help uh, also streamline or cut out the middlemen, not only for online uh, sellers and online buyers, but also in the bricks and mortars uh, world. And how would they do that? Well, this uh, ecosystem will also work in the real world. So let's say you go to a mall and, uh, you know, it will keep track of you through Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. And if you're in it, uh, you know, uh, it will help the, you know, sellers and consumers alike. So they actually think this could also revive the bricks and mortars uh, retailers. Um, so, yeah, very interesting. What are the downsides? Well, with all these uh, ICOs, uh, the downside is that uh, we are in such, you know, we are like in the beginning of the first inning, so to speak. Not even, in the, you know, I think it's like the first batter is up. <laughs> you know, there's, they haven't had even had an out in the first inning. And that's where we are. So like uh, in the dot-com uh, boom or bubble um, of the 90s, uh, mid-90s, late 90s, there's a lot of companies that are going to come out you know, try to exploit this new technology of uh, blockchain and the decentralization. Uh, a lot of them will survive. A lot of them won't. Uh, it's up to you to decide. Uh, and uh, yeah, this is just another opportunity in this, uh, you know, fast developing uh, technology and business, you know, business section. So that's Bitclave. Uh, cat token or consumer activity token i'll put all the details below uh, in the description uh, for their website and uh, if you're interested you have to like sign up to their wallet and the other thing as well just before i go uh, they're going to come out with the alpha version of their uh you know application uh i think in the middle of september just a, a day or two before the ico starts so as a consumer, you'll be able to go in there already before the ICO and sign up uh, to, you know, sign into this uh, new ecosystem. It's like signing in for Facebook. And uh, if you decide to, uh, you know, there will be a questionnaire. If you decide to answer all the questions, you have the potential to get more tokens. But if you don't, if you don't want to give a lot of details about yourself, you won't uh, get as many tokens when you search for the product that you want. So that's it. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please like, share it. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do.